Welcome to, um, what is today? Tuesday. I must have Wednesday again. This morning on my coffee chat, I was convinced it was Wednesday, but it turns out it's actually Tuesday. <laughs> Hello. Um, I'm just hopping on my computer real quick to turn this to subscribers only. It was crazy that this morning during our coffee chat, even after I switched it to subscribers only, we still had an issue with a troll, but we'll make sure it works. I'm just gonna clean my lens real quick, so give me one second. It's here. That's better. <laughs> I do give you guys the warning, because the ASMR um, is a little intense for some people. Okay, um, shop the shop. Let's see, customization, subscribers only. Save. All right, we're good. Okay, so um, I have a few things preloaded for today's sale. Um, just a couple of things. Uh, Sage is actually working in the back on preloading some stuff, which is amazing. Uh, but I have some stuff out here in the front. <laughs> oh, awesome. Thank you for listening while you work. I did not flip on the lights today, so I'm going to do that now. This is kind of funny. Look at this. You can tell Andrew was in the shop because the cat is turned back around. This is a constant battle. Here we go. I think the cat's just going to come over and live with us at the new place eventually. <laughs> um, let me move this tape over. Um, so what we're going to do today is we are going to shop the shop. Let me sit down to give this whole dialogue. And we're going to shop the shop today. So what that means is we are going to walk around the shop. <laughs> and you guys are going to be able to pick out stuff from recent videos that you see out on my tables. Um, and say, hey, will you run that? And in most cases, I'll say, yes, let's sell it. And um, so that is what uh, this this sale basically is. Um, oh, thank you. <laughs> um, so, so basically that's what we're doing today. We are selling stuff from the shop. Um, I am casting, I'm multicasting to both Facebook and YouTube. So right now this sale is happening on knickknacks.net. That is N-I-K-N-A-X dot net. That is where the sale is taking place. We are multicasting to Facebook and YouTube, which means we are sending out the signal to Facebook and YouTube, but we are not currently on either of those places. Um, you have to come over to Knickknacks to join us and to partake in the sale if you want to. Um, if you want to bid on the on the items, if you want to participate in in the chat you have to be here on knickknacks um so if you just want to watch you're more than welcome to watch on youtube and facebook but if you see something you like and you want to bid on it um you have to be here on knickknacks so um to get to knickknacks you can type niknax.net into your web browser or you can go to district.net and you should see um, the live stream playing. You can click on that. Um, that'll bring you here to us and you can hang out with us. So that is how you can get here. <laughs> I see a question mark, but I don't understand the question. Are you moving my shop? I am moving my e-commerce. I am moving my internet business out of my shop so that I can turn my shop into a store. And that makes sense. <laughs> so right now, um, this is a little bit of everything. And my goal is to move the web sales and everything out of here and actually turn this into its originally intended purpose, which was to be an antique shop. And for those of you who don't know, we, we got this space in the beginning of 2020. And then the world shut down. And so we were like, okay, now what do we do? We have this huge space and the world is shut down. And so we just went full into e-commerce and we've been that way ever since. Um, but now we're, we're kind of shifting gears and we're like, okay, well, maybe now is the time four years later that we're going to actually open 
an antique store. So that's the direction we're heading. So, <laughs> all right. So let's sell some stuff. That is the goal today. At 318, we are raiding into my good friend Christina, Moon Sky Vintage. And I'm sending you guys on to a groovy train. A very groovy train for the rest of the year. Yeah, it's been a busy four years. It's been crazy. I had I we bought a house. We had a baby. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <I mean. laughs> That's a lot. <laughs> All right. So um, let's start with what we have preloaded. Um, and then we will go from, oh, yeah, and I remodeled the house. And then I rented out a house. And then I rented out a house again. It's just, it's been, it's been a wild ride. You know, it's been a whole thing. Um, All right. Let me flip you guys around. Maybe. There we go. Okay. Oh, and then I started a marketplace. I did that also in the last few months. So... Um, and this is, this is the best marketplace around of all the places that you can be. So, um, let's see here. What do we have? Um, let's, um, what should we start with? Hmm. How about the vanity dish? Here we go. Move to stage. Okay. Here we go. We are going to say, yes. <laughs> oh, you guys are so sweet. I could have said it and then I was like, I shouldn't have said that. But then... Like, I, I appreciate your confirmation <laughs> to something I probably shouldn't have said out loud. <laughs> oh, shoot. All right. So next, we have, first, first, not next, but first we have this. This is like me this morning when I'm like, um, <laughs> today's Wednesday. And I'm like, no, actually, today's Tuesday. Today has just been a day of like saying things out loud that I probably shouldn't say and forgetting what day it is. Um, but hey, listen, I ordered some coffee on DoorDash just before I started this sale. And then I'll just, I'll, I'll be back on track. I'll be caffeinated and I'll, I'll maybe remember what month it is and we'll be in good shape. So, <laughs> so first we're going to sell this um, powder box. Um, this is a satin glass powder box. I got this at auction, so you guys did not see it in video. There's a few items I bought at auction um, here. Uh, this included. You guys were really excited about this chocolate slag glass last week, and I'm I'm like, oh, okay. Um, I found another piece of it. This unfortunately does have a chip on one of the um, the edges, but I found some more of that, and then also this was from auction. I have to find a black light to test this before we sell it, but. Um, maybe I can ask Sage if she has a black light. Um, all these items are preloaded, so I don't have to post it them. Once we get through the preloads, we will have to pull out the post-its. Um, but we are going to start with this first. Like I said, uh, satin glass, so it has a satin finish. There's some scuffing on it, but there's no chips or cracks. It has a uh, four-leaf clover on the front. And, uh, yeah, we're going to start that at $4.30. And it's right. A vanity box, probably for powder or for hearts. Yes, it could also be for hearts. It's probably part of a set, so unfortunately, we only have one piece of the set. Cat things. Oh, that's a good question. I sold quite a few uh, cat things. <laughs> oh, we have a raid. Did we get a raid from American Grown Up? Thank you so much for the raid. That is wonderful. Thank you, thank you. Awesome, welcome raiders. Oh my gosh, I would say everybody follow American Grown Up, but we're not there yet. We will be soon. We will be soon. I hope you had a wonderful sale. Um, it does bucks glow. I don't know. Everybody loves cat things. Oh, <laughs> thank you for the hearts. <laughs> oh, from Greece. Wow. All the way from Greece. Oh, yes. Yes. American Grown Up is wonderful. Wonderful. It always brings really amazing things. You know, I was eyeing up those stretchy pants. I know that's crazy to say. Of all the great things that you bring to your sales, the one time you were selling those stretchy pants, and I was like, those pants look so comfortable. 
And I was like, I need to get me a pair of those stretchy pants because honestly, half the time I leave the house and I'm like, I don't feel like putting on real world pants right now. And I just want to wear a pair of stretchy pants. And they looked like a really good option for days like those. <laughs> oh, really? Real, you know, real like these, like like jeans and stuff, real world pants. Where people, where people don't judge you because you're like wearing their pants. You're like, they're like, oh yeah, you're wearing real world pants. <laughs> I feel like yoga pants don't count as as real world pants. Um, is this a lucky box? I think it is. I feel like it should be. Um, <laughs> looks like H Doe is our winner for $22. Congratulations. And thank you very much for your purchase. That's one thing I've told Sage and anyone who's ever worked with me is like, I don't care how you come to work. You can wear whatever you want. I don't care. And I always thought Kate would be the one that like took that to the next level. And she really never pushed that. She never really, like, showed up in anything too crazy. <laughs> but I always thought Kate would be the one. I'm like, Kate's going to show up in something really crazy. But no, she didn't. She was just regular, real-world stuff. Um, all right, let's grab these. Um, sure. Yeah, can you grab me a black light too? I mean, you don't have to rush. I still have quite a few things to go through. You're like running. I'm like, you don't have to run. You can like casually yeah. like, but also can you grab me the black light when you come out? Thank you. <laughs> um, no, no, she never wore one of those to work. No. Oh, it's really high. Okay, let me double check. I might have put it in wrong. Edit item. I have it set to 12 ounces. So 12 ounces. I think it should be good. Oh, you mean the big owl. Okay, I'll have to double check. I will double check on the, the big owl. He's very heavy because <coughs> you can hear, <laughs> hear how loud it takes to set him We'll double check on him when we get to him. Um, we're going to... Like the, she never wore one of those. No, no, she never wore a McDonald's. Um, we're we're gonna uh, run these Shawnee Owl shakers. They're the Winky Owls. I didn't see anything, um, any damage on them. One is missing a cork. Um, but we are gonna sort those at four dollars thirty seconds. And there we go. I know. I. I. It's so funny. We were at the Airbnb. That was the. That was the day I was there with George, and we're all just chilling there. And she comes downstairs, and she's wearing that McDonald's dress. I'm like, oh, that's cool. <laughs> like, <laughs> I love her style. She's got the best style, and she's always had really great style. She's always had great stuff. The big owl is a weapon. That's so funny. Oh yeah. yeah, I don't know anyone that could pull pull off a McDonald's dress from the seventies like Kate can. So so it's thirty seconds, um, and then it's a slow close. So if anybody bids, um, it restarts. Looks like they sold for six dollars to Sherry Lee one zero zero seven. Thank you for your purchase. And congratulations on the shakers. Sit this back in the back. Um, we are using USPS ground. Yes, it's cheaper. We just chose chose the cheaper route. And that's why. I mean, I could do priority, but I tried to do the most um, cost effective. You are. Thank you. Thank you. Let's do these glasses. I swear, every time I do a live, it's like sirens are going off. You guys must think I live like in the most dangerous city in the world. Um, okay, <laughs> so next we have these cups. <laughs> They're really fun. I don't know if uh, the color is added or if uh, actually that. No, we don't have uh, sticky notes until we get... Um, to items that are not 
preloaded. I'm going to sell these cups. I just thought they were really fun colors. I love how vibrant they are. Um, and you're getting the set of four. Uh, we're going to start them at eight dollars. And there they go. They are running. You are getting the set of four. And there's no markings on them either. No markings. You've applied to sell. That's awesome. 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 I'm going to try to get through applications tonight. I know I've been saying that. It's just been a really busy few, <laughs> few days. I wish I had a water, but I feel like I left my water in my office. I may have to take a walk to my office. Although I do have coffee coming. I do have coffee coming. Glitter and grit. Thank you so much for your purchase. $15 on the cups. Let me just set those back here. Very carefully. Okay. All righty. Rooster. Oh, no, we're not. I don't think Sage wants to ship that rooster. Sage, do you want to ship the rooster? <laughs> yes, that one. I mean, I will if I, <laughs> I will if I have to. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, let's see. What do we have on here? Stuff that I have immediately available. Um, let's do this chocolate slag. Move to stage. Okay, so we have this chocolate slag glass dish. Um, like I said, you guys were really excited about a piece of this. Um, yes, I'm gonna I'm gonna check the shipping on this before I run it. I'm gonna check the shipping on it. Um, but uh, this does have a chip right here. I don't know who made. Oh yeah, you wanna check this? Here. Let's see if it goes. It does not. I didn't think it was going to, but I wanted to double check. Thank you for checking. You're welcome. I don't think anything else here is exciting. Um, so we are going to start this at $4. It has a, a pre bit. Hi, Sweden. Oh, my gosh. That's so exciting. Marie from Sweden. Hello, hello. It's got little feet, too. I forget who makes it. You guys told me last, uh, last week. Cat has great uh, cat cat the nurse flipper. Oh yes, she's got really fantastic items. She buys a lot from auction, and she, oh my gosh, some of the things she gets from auction that like it's just absolutely insane. She's the one who actually encouraged me to start to start sourcing in auctions. She encourages a lot people a lot of people to start sourcing. Oh, my open toe shoes. I know, you know, today is one of the first days I've actually put on sandals. We probably need to get a pedicure. <laughs> Don't look at my toes. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Oh, we have a winner. I missed it. Bl Bloomin' 2 is our winner for $6.00 on the chocolate slag dish. Thank you very much. Congratulations on your purchase. We don't have to do post-its yet. Oh. Yeah, you're, you're, you don't have to post it. How does it feel? Pretty good. Your job right now, I'm gonna give you a really hard job. Are you ready? Okay. Your job right now is to just watch out the window and wait oh, for, for the coffee. The coffee. Oh. That's the hardest job in the shop right now. <laughs> Where are we? We are at the shop. Oh, there he is. Oh, my gosh. Literally walked up right when I said that. The coffee walked up. How great is that? That was such an easy job. Thank you, you too. Thank you. Sweet. Latte for you. Latte for me. <laughs> Fantastic. Thank you. You're welcome. I hope you like it. I hope so, too. I'm probably I feel like will. you should. I've got an extra shot of espresso in there for you. Any coffee is good coffee. <laughs> Maybe after this coffee, we'll remember what day it is. All right. I'm going to edit this um, Blanco Owl just to make sure I've got the right. Ooh, I know what I did wrong. 
get rates. Dun, dun, dun. You guys are right. I put in Priority Mail Express. That's why it was so expensive. Good, good catch, my friends. Good catch. All right, I'm fixing the owl. Move to stage. The shipping on the owl is fixed. Um, it is now <laughs> ground and not Priority Mail Express. So it should be a little bit more reasonable. Um, I do want to draw your attention to a slight ship here on the edge. It's kind of hard to see, but um, maybe from that angle you can see right there on the edge. Um, yes, much better. Okay, good. Um, thank you for catching that because I was like, what do you mean? It's not, it's heavy. <laughs> so I'm going to take a sip of coffee. Um, it is a clear Blanco owl. It has the sticker right on the forehead. I'm pretty sure this was part of my collection that ended up here at the shop and it's been sitting around and finally I was like, you know what? <laughs> I'm just going to sell it. Um, so it's $20 start and it's going to run for 30 seconds. And there it goes. It is running. Yes. If you're watching over on Facebook or YouTube, um, hop on over to knickknacks.net in order to join us. Um, we are currently on knickknacks, so that is N-I-K-N-A-X.net. That is where the sale is taking place. We are multicasting, which means we are we are broadcasting the sale out to Facebook and YouTube, but the sale is actually taking place on knickknacks. So you're able to watch it, but in order to participate, you have to be on knickknacks. So N-I-K-N-A-X dot net. That is where you need to go. And I'm pretty sure at this point, it's Googleable. So you can just type in Google, knickknacks. <laughs> I think we've gotten to that point where you can Google us, <laughs> which is really exciting. Um, they are still working on international shipping. I get an update every meeting, and I know they are working really hard at it. Um, it's not easy because of all the conversions and all, all of the, the hoops they have to jump through, but I promise you that it is being worked on. And as, as, soon, as, uh, as soon as I hear anything, I will absolutely let you guys know. Um, it does not glow with my base. Well, it kind of glows. I guess it's a kind of glow, right? I mean, it's just like a basic black light. I feel like if you had like a, a not basic black light, if you had one of those fancy black lights, it would probably really glow. But this is your most basic, basic black light. <laughs> so uh, it looks like our winner is Mama G4. Congratulations. Thank you for your purchase, Mama G. And uh, we're going to set this over here on the cart. Pass it over to Sage and her fancy nails. <laughs> Is it? No, Kate and I have the same black light. Janet gave us both a fancy black light. She gave us both one. We're matchy match. <laughs> All right, let me grab another item. Um, let's do um, the sheep. Move to a stage. All right. This is so fun. It's so it, I don't think it's real functional. Like I don't think it's actually supposed to be functional, but it's a very primitive style of sheep. I don't know if this is like primitives by Kathy or something like that. Uh, there was no stickers or anything on it, uh, but it is a sheep on wheels. Every sheep needs some wheels. Um, it has a pre bid of six dollars, and we're gonna run it for thirty seconds. And there it goes. It's running. You collect sheep. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm sorry that we do not yet have international shipping. We will get there. I promise. I am promising you on behalf of district that there will be international shipping someday. Yeah, there's, there's a whole lot of hoops to jump through to make it happen. But I, I have confidence that they're they're working through it. Uh, 
Um, no, I have not stopped selling on whatnot. I'm just not selling as much over there. <laughs> Th this is my um, this is my marketplace in more ways than one. I mean, yes, I own it, but also I just feel a lot. I feel a lot more at home here. Bandit Johnson 24 is our winner for $31. Thank you, Bandit. Congratulations on this really fun sheep on wheels. <laughs> it's very cute. I hand that off the stage for you. Let's grab another. Um, let's see. I'm going to filter this by auction. It's probably easier that way anyway. Um, let's see. What else do we have in front of us? Let's do this. This fun rooster. So this is uh, from Portugal. It is made in Portugal. It is a rooster. I know there's some sort of folklore behind these. I don't know exactly what it is, but I'm sure you can Google it. Um, I don't know if anybody has chose. I didn't know if anyone chose uh, Portugal for the where in the world train, but I'm sure. I'm sure there will probably be, if they did, um, a rooster or two in the where in the world train. And uh, we're we're gonna run this. It's gonna start at 22. That is the pre bid, and it's going to run for 30 seconds. There it goes. It is running. Some of these roosters can be really, really colorful. Those are my favorites. Wow, we have 867 watching. That's really exciting. Folk art rooster, yes. Yeah, come on. I see Sienna over there on Facebook. She's everywhere. She's on YouTube. She's on Facebook. She's telling everybody to come on over to Knickknacks. Come on, join us. <laughs> Knickknacks.net. We can participate in the sale. <laughs> After I get tonight's video done, I will work on uh, some applications. You are applying to sell on knickknacks. Just if you're selling on any other platforms, if you're selling on eBay, if you're selling on Mercari, uh, Poshmark, um, whatnot, include those links in your application so that um, it's easier for me to just look at those and be like, oh yeah, you're a great seller. I see you've got great feedback. You have great items that you, know, you ship out on time and I can just put you right through. All right, so that is, that is your ticket. If you if you include links to other selling platforms, it's usually a really quick thing. Um, all right, it looks like Skeeter ninety six is our winner for forty eight dollars. Thank you very much for your purchase. Congratulations on the rooster. And I'm actually going to hand you these as well because these sold earlier. Thank you. So if you're just starting out and you have not sold anywhere else. And you told me that in the application, let me turn you around. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to deny you, but don't freak out. Just read your rejection because in the rejection, there's gonna be instructions for um, submitting photos of this, the items you intend to sell. And all I wanna see is like, okay, these are the items I'm gonna be selling on knickknacks. And um, yeah, I'll just review your photos and put you through. So that's pretty much the gist of it. So if you haven't sold anywhere, just, um, just read your rejection, but send me a, send me an application anyway. Um, and just go through and tell me a little bit about yourself and why you want to sell, why you're interested in knickknacks and, uh, just be honest. And, uh, maybe you sold previously and you're not selling anymore. Tell me why. Um, and, uh, yeah, you'll get a rejection, but, uh, it'll just basically be like, Hey, okay, well send me some photos to this email address and uh, we'll go from there. Okay. Yeah, no livestock, no real cats. <laughs> no real cats. All right, I've got like, I think one more here and then we'll move over to the other stuff. <laughs> Annalise, nice to see you. It's always good to see you because you share a name with my sister. That's always exciting. Let me see here. 
let's do this. Move to storage. Okay, so Sage and I just tested this. Um, yes, you can be a seller on knickknacks from Sweden, but we do not have that ability yet. Once we're able to accept international sellers, absolutely. Uh, we just have to get there. But absolutely, I have no problem with international sellers applying. Um, we just have to be able to facilitate that. And step one is being able to facilitate international shipping. So we, we just have to go through the steps. <laughs> so for, first step is international shipping, but we will get there. Um, okay, so this is uh, a green opalescent glass dish. I didn't know the pattern on the fly, uh, but it is really pretty. Uh, Sage and I tested it. It does not glow under black light. Can see here this is the black light it does not glow um so pre-bid on this is 15 dollars um and it's going to run for 30 seconds and there it goes it's running oh absolutely thank you for commenting it's really exciting to know that uh, someone from sweden is interested in selling on knickknacks i know i'm excited about that <laughs> i i feel like sienna and the rest of district would be really excited about that too Um, so I was born um, in Newburyport, <laughs> Massachusetts, um, and I spent a few years in Cape Cod in Sandwich, and then my family moved to Kansas for a few years, and then back to New England, and we lived in Rhode Island in East Greenwich, and then we moved to Pennsylvania, and I've been here ever since. We have a winner. It is Heart to Heart Treasures. Congratulations. Thank you very much. $25 on the dish. Thank you, Sage. Yeah. All right. So I think we have everything over here done. So I'm going to move over here. I'm going to try not to get my coffee mis mixed up with yours. <laughs> All right. Done in this <laughs> <laughs> it's good right yeah it is um okay so this is the stuff sage listed for all of you everybody say yay for sage <laughs> she did a wonderful job <laughs> um we're gonna start with this item right here um uh, i believe this is moon and star oh i know it's moon and stars i think it's ellie smith so ellie smith then sold the molds to different companies various companies so I'm always really hesitant to say Ellie Smith, but I'm pretty confident this is an Ellie Smith Moon and Stars canister. Uh, it, is, it does come in different colors. This one just happens to be amber, and this is a smaller version. Um, I don't see any chips or cracks. A lot of the times these are really chipped up. It does look like there might be a crack there when you turn it just right. Um, but other than that, I think we're, we're doing pretty good. Sometimes they're like really chipped up, but it is the small version. Everybody says great job, Sage. Yay. Yay. <laughs> All right. So we're going to start this at 11, which is the pre-bit and it's going to run for 30 seconds. And uh, there it goes. It's just a little guy. Yes, yes, there's always, it seems like they're always chipped up. I, f I forget where I got the last one. I think the last one I sold had like a ton of chips. And I had to tell you guys like, oh my gosh, look at this. And it was all chipped up on the inside. So this one is like, this one's pretty decent considering. Tea bags, yes. A nice cookie jar. <laughs> With just the right amount of cookies, I feel like. <laughs> Mini cookies. <laughs> yeah, so the, yes, of course, the uh, little crack, where is it? Right there. Is invisible when it's on. Um, so if you click on, there should be like a little eye like for information, like a little eye. If you click on the eye, the shipping is calculated uh, based on your location. Um, so you should be able to click on the eye and see what the shipping is. I am in Carlisle, Pennsylvania. 
So the shipping should be calculated from Pennsylvania. All right, we have a winner, Bandit Johnson, $24.37. Thank you very much, Bandit. Congratulations on the canister. I'll take that under there for you. Um, so for live sales, uh, we don't accept PayPal, but for buy it now listings across the marketplace, you can pay using PayPal. Um, that's just a, a difference with, with the live sales. <laughs> so next we have this, this aqua and white blown art glass vase. Yay, Bandit! <laughs> hey, Annie, it's good to see you. Um, all right, so uh, this uh, is not marked. It is hand blown. And uh, yeah, I don't think there's much else to say about it. It is a nice piece. I don't think it glows. I don't know. We didn't test it, right? Probably, don't. I don't think, I don't see any reason why it would, but I feel like somebody's going to ask me. <laughs> and no, it does not glow. Um, so we are going to start this. Um, 23 is the pre-bid, and it's going to run for 30 seconds. And uh, there it goes. It is running. I think we're going to have time to run some other items, too. At least a couple of them. Maybe like two or three off the tables. Clear some of the table space. <laughs> I did do a lot of um, Buy It Now listings. How tall? Oh, let me tell you. I did do quite a few Buy It Now listings yesterday. Um, it is five and a quarter. Five and a quarter tall. Um, I am Cupid Doll is our winner for $33. Congratulations and thank you very much. Um, so if you want to see the Buy It Now listings, I do have some in my um, little house, like little house icon. You should be able to go to that um, and look at, actually, I'm going to add some of the other items in here real quick. Page got listed. Um, and then let me see here if I can add. Make sure the listings I added to the marketplace yesterday. Oops, that's not one of them. All right. Um, okay, I'll just stream. Okay, so I just added some buy it now listings of mine to the marketplace, so that way you guys didn't have to go seeking and searching them. Um, all right, let me add. Hmm. Now I have to switch back over to. That's kind of weird never done that to me before. Um, okay, let's move this to stage. This is a fused glass dish. It is round. It has like this um, textured, like frit on the outside, but it's not sharp to the touch. So it's just kind of um, convex, concave, yeah, but it is a trinket dish. No markings on it. Uh, we are going to start this at $4. And there it goes. It is right. Yes, so if you're watching on Facebook or YouTube, come and join us on Knickknacks. That is N-I-K-N-A-X dot net. We are not actually live on YouTube or Facebook, even though it looks that way. We are live on Knickknacks, and we are multicasting to Facebook and YouTube. So it only looks like we're live there. This, it's all an illusion. <laughs> you have to come to Knickknacks to join the sale. I know, I'm gonna like, I'd say your next big job to do mm -hmm. is to get some paint and just write 
knickknacks <laughs> on the car and every single cart we have you just point to it yeah and i'll be like it's right here on the car <laughs> here let me just like move all this stuff out of the way it's right here guys <laughs> it looks like margin is our winner for 11 dollars. congratulations on the dish oh you're so confused don't be confused what's confusing i'm sorry if i confused you what was confusing um, yes, I think you can view without logging in. I don't know. I've never tried. I would assume you can. Yes, Sienna says yes. Um, all right, let me stick this down here. Thank you for your purchase. Very carefully. I'm sure that sounded... I know. I keep get. I, I can't... Even, even this... <laughs> Sage is like, you're showing your toes. I'm like, mm, bang, girl. <laughs> no, well, I'm, I mean, I am live. I can see your comments. I'm kind of live. Your comments are getting pushed through to knickknacks. So I can see you. <laughs> but we're live, we're live on knickknacks, if that makes sense. Um, let's see. Let's grab another item. How about one of these cute little figurines of um Buffalo? Look at him. So these are made in Uruguay. Um, they're marked CH, so they're not Artesania Rinconada. <laughs> but they are. Oh, that's okay. That's all right. <laughs> no, that's all right. Um, but they are. Uh, they are made in Uruguay, and I don't know what the CH stands for. Um, so Sage put these in for me. She says, oh, darn, because she put Artesania Rinconada. It's okay. It's all right. It's all right. Today was the first day I left her to her own, and I'm like, here's some items to put in. Good luck. Um, so I think she did a really good job. She did a really great job. Um, but, yeah, so this is a buffalo and a baby, I think. That's what it is. Um, and they are pottery. So I can get you a measurement on these. No banner running. There, there is no banner. I don't think I have a hippo. Oops, wrong way. Let's do it this way. So they're about two and a half tall and about three and a half wide. It's okay, just breathe, Sage. <laughs> um, we're gonna we're gonna start it at twelve dollars. That is the rebid, and there it goes. It is running. Um, Lucille, I um I think Sienna is over on Facebook. She may be able to help you. Do I buy Death Row artwork? I don't think I've ever bought that before. I don't think I've ever bought that. Yes, there is a QR code. You can scan that QR code. Sage is doing an amazing job. <laughs> She's getting all the compliments. <laughs> How is hippos? Oh my gosh. So I have a hippo in next Wednesday sale. Um, it's the Halloween hippo. I don't know if I have it listed yet, though. But I do have lots of items for pre-bid. And I don't think I got to the hippo yet. Um, all right. Loudy <laughs> Doos is our winner for $19. Congratulations on the figurine. Oh, hang on one sec. I got Okay, um, so congratulations, $19 on the buffalo. I'm going to stick that right down here. How do you find future listings of sellers? Um, do you mean like uh, future listings? So if you mean like live sale listings, you need to go into their live sales and you can see the listings. Okay, hang on one second. All right, let me um, grab another. Let's do this. This is fun. Um, oops. Bye. Okay, so this is a blue uh, opalescent hobnail dish. Uh, it is Fenton. 
<laughs> yeah. Um, so <laughs> it's got two little handles on it. Um, now there is a little bit of a chip. I think that's a chip. I don't know. It's a rough spot. It's like a weird rough spot. It's not really sharp. It could be manufacturing. I'm not really sure. Uh, but let me give you a measurement on this. Yeah, that's a weird rough spot. It's not sharp, really. I don't know. Anyway, it measures about six and a half wide. And we're going to start it. Uh, Pre-bid on this is $11. And there it goes. It's running. Oh, that's so neat. So my grandma had a bunch of the, or my great aunt had a bunch of the um, cranberry opalescent. She had the cranberry opalescent. So I have a few, I have a few of her pieces. But when she died, my cousin sold it all. So <laughs> fortunately, my mom was able to rescue a few pieces. Anybody's, I don't know what a bonbon is. What is even a bonbon? <laughs> <laughs> Are you laughing? It's a chocolate. It's a chocolate? Is that what it is? That's why I don't know because I don't really like chocolate. <laughs> a bonbon dish. <laughs> That's funny. That's too funny. Everyone's like, candy! <laughs> chocolate! <laughs> Um, she's doing okay. She's doing okay. She's, 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 um, she's talking to the lamps and stuff. I feel like she really has earned the title of crazy lamp lady. <laughs> um, all right. So our winner is P. Canonizado. Three eight two nine nine zero. <laughs> Thank you for your purchase. Thirty one dollars on the Fenton. Let me stick this down here. Ah, you know what? If if you wouldn't mind going to grab a couple stickers, we can put them on the cart, like the knickknack stickers with the uh, URL on them, yeah. and then we can show them to people. Okay. Thank you, Sage. That's what we'll do. We'll put stickers on the cart and then we'll just show you guys the stickers and then you'll know exactly. Right? That makes sense. Um, all right. So let's see. Um, how about we run this? Okay. So next we have this. I, th I think I got this at Goodwill, didn't I? I don't know. You guys probably remember better than I do. I just thought it was a really adorable graphic. <laughs> It is Price Japan. It's it's not really my style or something I would typically pick up, but I just thought the graphic was so cute. The mama hen with her little uh, hat on or hat. I think that's a bandana or something. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's like a little milk jug, the country decor. Um, $10 is the pre-bid and it is 30 seconds. And there it goes. It's running. Yeah, we just want to set them down. I don't think we actually have to stick them. them on there. There you go. Knickknacks.net. <laughs> right here. This is the address. Ta-da. She's wearing her handkerchief. Oh, there you go. All right. P. Canonizado is our winner for 31. Oh, wait. That's not what you want it for. That was already done. Um, <laughs> like, wait. This isn't Fenton. <laughs> <laughs> That was some lag. She looks like she's not pleased. I don't know. She just looks really intense. Her pupils are very dilated. <laughs> Purple Haze, thank you for your purchase. Congratulations, $12. That is awesome. I appreciate that. Thank you. Let me set that back down in there. Eating <laughs> magic plushies. Oh, shoot. I, I thought so. I really thought so, but I didn't want to say that in case I, like, I was mistaken. But thank you very much. I do appreciate that. Let me grab this. Move to stage. 
Oh no, that's okay. That's perfectly fine. I appreciate I appreciate you getting that taken care of. I was just confused because it popped up again and I was like, did I do something wrong? <laughs> Um, all right, so here we have some carnival glass. This is a carnival glass cup. You can see the base color is blue. Uh, my favorite carnival glass pieces are when you look at them and you can't tell what the base color is, um, and then you have to hold it up to the light to really see. Uh, obviously, this is cobalt um, when you hold it to the light. I believe our theme next week is going to be uh, to the carnival or something to that effect. Um, so there's going to be lots of carnival glass and uh, chalkware. Oh, we put them all in the booth. Um, <laughs> chocolate <laughs> carnival prizes and whatnot. Um, stuff, fun stuff like that. So uh, like carnival, um, carnival stuff. And uh, the pieces like this, the reason it's called carnival glass is because it was actually given out as carnival prizes. Um, and it was made to imitate the Favreau glass uh, that was coming out in France. Um, so it's just, it's really fun. But uh, what is the size on this? Let me see. It is... Uh, almost four inches tall and uh, we have uh, we're gonna start it at 20 bucks and pre-bid oh, I'm sorry and it's gonna run for 30 seconds alrighty and it is a shell mug um let's have it here we go it is running that is really pretty mm -hmm. I can't remember where I got this from I'm assuming it's only hand wash, right? Uh, yeah, I would, just because it's old. Most of these pieces are from the early 1900s. There is Merc Contemporary Carnival, um, but this specific piece, I was looking to see if I had any, um, but this specific piece would be from the early 1900s. Isn't that neat? Yeah, I have a collection of some of it at home in the China cabinet. I have a really awesome piece in my office that Daryl wants. <laughs> I'm like, he keeps messaging me about it. I'm like, I have it. It's safe, Daryl. He's so excited about it. I have to go visit him soon. <laughs> Isn't this so really cool? Uh, Bandit Johnson 24, you are our winner. Thank you, Bandit, for your purchase. $29 on the shell cup. I will set that down here for you. Thank you, Bandit. Yay, Bandit! <laughs> Let me grab another, move to stage. We have this. Um, this is really interesting. This is a Homer Lachlan piece. Um, there is their logo right there. Um, some, some people may not recognize that logo, uh, but it is a uh, Gothic USA. Um, I've never seen a piece like this before. I wasn't familiar with this design, um, but it does have their logo. Um, it's kind of neat. It has a, a, a green band on it. Um, and we are going to start it at $10. It's going to run for 30 seconds. And there it goes. <laughs> So funny, I was watching, I think it was a Dr. Lori video once, and uh, she had a piece of Homer Lachlan, and she didn't, she couldn't, she didn't know the mark. And I was, I was screaming at Andrew, I'm like, it's Homer Lachlan, it's Homer, it's an HL, it's Homer Lachlan. <laughs> Who is that, Dr. Uh, she's, she's another YouTuber. Oh. She knows a lot of things, but she didn't know Homer Lachlan, she didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> you knew that you listed this good job sage well i researched it. you researched it you did you did a good job you researched <laughs> it um tara win is our winner for 17 dollars thank you so much congratulations on your purchase this is a really cool vase it's very like unique stuff. I'd never seen this before. So um, I think that's pretty great. And I'll set it down here for you. And we are going to grab another. Uh, this. Move to state. I think I found this at Thermont Goodwill. Yes, I was really proud of her for looking the things up. I'm like looking at the items. I'm like, oh my <laughs> gosh. I told her just to call them whatever she wanted. And I expected like some wild names for these things. And she got, she's got like Dugan. She has Fenton. She's got like Homer Lock. I'm like, wow, this is really, really cool. Um, all right. So this is uh, Kemper. 
Kempel, she's got that in there too. Look at that. She's got K Kempel uh, Wheaton Amber Glass Trinket Box. <laughs> I think I found this one at Thermont. Um, there are some rough edges that I can feel with my fingers, um, but it does have a very like decorative edge. So you can't really see the chips. You can just kind of feel them. Um, let's put that down here. Hold on. Am I not putting that down? This is like a weird, like it's a puzzle lid. You guys, there we go. Okay, we got it on. We're not going to take it off again. Um, so it's got a pre bit of $10, and we're going to run it for 30 seconds. I know, Andrew would come up with some really wild uh, names for these things. <laughs> I don't know if you saw it. Wasn't that your first yes. day with a pig sale? The pigs, the yeah. pigs you, you got to see. <laughs> Sage's first day was right after we did our pig sale over on Whatnot, and she got to see some of the creative um, titles for the pigs. She was probably like, what did I get myself into? <laughs> <laughs> see if it was like all pigs and stuff like that i probably would have done the same thing yeah it's more like glass that's so funny <laughs> it was so crazy he came up with some real creative uh creative names for those things <laughs> Right, P. Canonizado. I'm gonna get that right eventually. Three eight two nine nine zero is our winner for twenty two dollars on the vintage vanity trinket box. We will set that down here very carefully. All right, there it goes. Okay, um, let me grab another. Ooh, we're moving right through. He's moved to stage. Okay, we are gonna do this little guy. Um, again, this is probably not our Dasanya. This one's actually not marked on the bottom. Um, it may have been and they scraped it off. I don't know why they would do that. Um, it probably also said CH. I noticed the common theme with all of these figurines that we got were that they had a mama and a baby. So the last one was a um, buffalo and a baby. And then last sale, I think we sold a, a cat and a, like they were all a pair. Um, so it is made in Uruguay. It's not Artist on your Rinconada, but it's very similar in style. It has that glaze with the matte finish. Um, oh, yeah, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We'll get it figured out. Um, so th this is a pre-bid of $12. And we are going to start it at 30 I'm sorry, it's going to run for 30 seconds. And there it goes. I think the pig sale might have been saved on YouTube. I think it might be over there. Um, I don't, I don't know if I set it to members only or for it's still public. <laughs> I noticed that when I do live sales, my views drop on my channel. So I was, I was leaving my live sales public for a few days and then changing them to members only. But I know everybody enjoyed the pig sale so much that I left it public for longer <laughs> because people were rewatching it for so long, but I'm not sure. It was pretty good. <laughs> Samuel Sheep. <laughs> I just like to say that. Yeah, it's Samuel Sheep and his baby. You named him Samuel. <laughs> the other one is Bill. <laughs> I totally missed that. <laughs> that makes me laugh so hard. <laughs> It just, it just occurred to me that you named them. <laughs> That's so good. Yeah, mom and baby. That's so mom good. And dad. That is so good. All right. So our winner is Loudy Deuce. Thank you so much. Congratulations on your purchase of these really cute little sheep creatures. <laughs> Samuel and baby. <laughs> for $16. I'm going to stick that down here. <laughs> Let me grab another one. Um, let's do this. Move to a state. Okay. We have this dog. Mom actually picked this up off the table. I think this was mom. Or was it that you? I think mom handed it to you, right? It wasn't me. Yeah, mom was like, we should do this. I was like, okay. Um, it is a glass. I 
think it's – well, it's definitely a hound dog. I don't know if this is a basset hound or not. Um, I was talking to Donna, who runs uh, Moon Doggy Coffee. I was like, you know, you should think about having a district um, for your 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 uh, basset hound charity. I think that would be really cool to have a, have a district um, for her charity. So anyway, I put the thought in her head. But anyway, we're going to run this. Um, it has a $4 starting bid. Sage did not name him. He's just sad basset hound. Um, we're going to start at uh, 30 seconds. And there it goes. It is running. I know. Isn't he so sweet? <laughs> He's so sweet. You have one in your booth. Awesome. 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 He is really cute. There's no markings on him. The booths take a lot of work. You get out of your booth what you put into your booth. That's for sure. A duchess. Aww. <laughs> Did the kitty come back? You know, that's so funny because I have a company that handles my Facebook um, account, my Crazy Lamp Lady Facebook account, and they repost my reels. So that video of the cat was like from forever ago, um, but that cat still comes around. That cat patrols my house almost every single night. But that video that they reposted was from, I don't know, a year, a year and a half ago. Um, Paveen Straw, 191327 is our winner for $22. Thank you for your purchase and congratulations on the Basset Hounds. I'll set that right down here. You know, we live in an old farmhouse and one of my big fears is getting mice. <laughs> we have, we have pest control come out and like, and like bait for them constantly because I'm like I don't want mice we live in an old farmhouse I don't want mice um and and so I'm like well on the bright Andrew's like I don't like the cats I'm like well on the bright side they're patrolling every single night making sure that we do not get mice so there's that because there's actually I think two or three of them that patrol the house every night and I see them on the cameras and they just walk around the outside of the house they've like worn a path around the house it is so bizarre because we don't interact with them. They just walk around the house. Like, all night. Just walk in circles around the house. It's so weird. <laughs> it's just, I don't know. I don't know where they came from. But they don't, they don't interact with us. They run away from us. But, hey. We kind of have cats. So, that's cool. Um, all right. Let's see here. Oh, maybe I don't. Oh, I already have them pinned. That's why. So these are Gans. These are Bella Casa by Gans. Uh, they're really kind of cute. They've got little feet on them. Um, these Bella Casa pieces have a tendency to chip really easily uh, because they're made of a thin ceramic. But we've got one little chip right here on the edge. And other than that, uh, maybe right there. So there's very minimal chipping considering that they chip very easily. And you're getting both bowls. We're going to serve them at 10. And they're running. A modern ranch chicken. Oh, my gosh. Four inside cats. Oh, my goodness. That's nuts. Oops, I should probably be showing these, huh? <laughs> Yeah, you like the stickers? So here's something exciting. I actually ordered 5,000 of these. <laughs> that sounds crazy. But I did. I ordered 5,000 of these. Oh, you know, I can't remember if I ordered 5,000 of these or 5,000 of these. Um, but I ordered 5,000 of these. And um, I'm going to be selling them as lots of like 50 on knickknacks at like a, a few cents above my cost to sellers. Um, so that you guys can purchase them and use them as marketing materials. Right now, I don't have very many. So I think I have lots of like maybe 
I think 15. Um, but I am going to be putting up lots of 50 at a time for just like a few cents above my cost. And then if, if you're a seller and you want to purchase them, I think this, this cost is going to work out to like 15 cents a piece, maybe 20 cents a piece. Um, and you can stick them in your packages or do whatever you want with them. Um, let's see. Jack Smith 89 is our winner. Thank you for your purchase. Ten dollars on the games bowls. Um, you know what? You get your own shelf right down here. <laughs> We've got two left. And then we might have time for like two items off the tables if you guys are interested. We'll walk around and see what you like. Let's do the Simon Pierce. This is exciting. Um, it is Simon Pierce. This can be really spendy stuff. I think I have a few pieces listed as buy it now. Um, but it is a, um, a votive holder. And uh, it's not signed. I don't think sometimes it's really subtly signed. But this one just has a sticker. It is heart shaped. And uh, $8 is the start. And it's going for 30 seconds. Purple Haze, you need one of those stickers for your collection. Which one? Both of them? <laughs> one. You just need one. Well, they're different. They're different stickers. Then there's another one, too. We have Just the Raccoon. I didn't get 5,000 of Just the Raccoon, though, because the Just the Raccoon isn't really promoting knickknacks. Most people will be like, oh, that's a cute raccoon. <laughs> that's a cute raccoon. And that's really as far as we would get with that. And then look what else I have. It was so funny because Christina messaged me yesterday about finding an egg separator and how excited she was. And I literally just saw this on the shelf at the same time. I was like, oh my gosh, that's so fun. Um, all right. <laughs> so it looks like Sue's DC is our winner for $22 on the Simon Pierce heart uh, votive holder. I will set that down here. Thank you very much. And then we have this. And then maybe we'll grab two items off the um, off the tables. And tomorrow I have another shop the sh shop the shop at four o'clock. Um, so tomorrow we have another shop the shop. Um, let's do um, this. Move to a stage. We have a pre bid on this. This is an egg separator. Yes, tomorrow at 4 o'clock is a shop the shop. Um, so that'll be fun. Here is the bottom. W Beers. <laughs> Happy Guy Egg Separator. <laughs> we're going to start it at $8. That is the pre-bid. It's going to run for 30 seconds. Um, and then we're going to go grab some stuff off of the tables. And get ready to raid into Moon Sky. Isn't he cute? He separates your eggs, but it also looks like he's throwing them up. So you have to um, accept that that's going to be the case. <laughs> you have to be prepared for the action of throwing up the eggs. Separating slash, you know. <laughs> I know, isn't it so fun? Hey, Junk Monkey! <laughs> on the gravy boat. <laughs> this is too funny. I think I have a fun item for you guys um, to run next. That I think, oh, I'll show you where it's at on the table. And I'll see if you guys pick it. Because I think you would. If I just, like, point the camera at that side of the table, you're going to be like, oh, that one. We'll see. Molly Megan, thank you for your purchase. Twenty dollars on the egg separator, fantastic! All right, I'm gonna set it down here for you. We're gonna go pick two items from the table, and then we're gonna raid into Moon Sky. All right. 
So we're going to come over this direction. And I want you guys to pick two items that you would like me to run. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> so you let me know. Yes, you know, we have not had a single, like, knock on wood. I tell Sage this every time. She has not broken, we've, not a single item has broken since Sage has been working with us. How amazing is that? So this will be in next Wednesday's Halloween sale. I'm having a Halloween sale next Wednesday. Most of the items are preloaded, um, but that will be in next <laughs> Pink Jack. That's what I was thinking you guys were going to say. It's Jack in the pulpit. Um, <laughs> right? That's the one? That Jack in the pulpit? Is that the one you want me to run? <laughs> okay. Yeah, so this will be in next Wednesday sale. Um, it's going to start at... 5 30 next Wednesday. So I'm switching it up. I'm not doing it at 4. I'm doing it at 5 30. And I'm running Halloween stuff. And I don't think I'm going to have enough Halloween stuff for a full sale. So I'll probably throw some other stuff in there. But it's going to be a lot of Halloween stuff. How do you bid? Okay, so if you're over on Facebook or YouTube, you got to come over and join us on knickknacks.net. Um, that is N-I-K-N-A-X dot net. Right here. Knickknacks dot net. Come on over and you can participate in the sale. You can bid. You can chat. You can hang out. But this is where we're at. Knickknacks. And, and you just you go over here and then you look for the live streams tab. And uh, you can join us. All right. So, yes, if you're watching on YouTube, watching on Facebook, come and join us. Um, we're going to be raiding into Moon Sky Vintage next. And when and when we do that raid, uh, unfortunately, if you're watching over anywhere else, you won't be able to, uh, to go with us. Unless you're here. So, now's your chance. <laughs> All right. Let's do the Tonala first. And then we'll, uh, we'll do this beauty, which does glow like crazy. That's so good. Okay. So <laughs> let's do this. Um, we're going to do, I'm going to add it on the fly. We're going to do auction tonoa pottery owl figurine. We're going to start it at $8. Pre bids on 30 seconds. Already at the stream. All right, let's do it. He's uh, he's uh, he's not actually a pottery owl. He's a potter owl. In his spare time, he enjoys um, pottery making. Um, so there's no markings on this. It is Tonala Mexico pottery. Um, here is the back. You can see there is a little bit of wear on the design here. Um, and he is, let me get you a measurement on this. <laughs> Sage just blessed me. I don't know where she went. She's in charge of the post-its. Um, four and a half inches. She may have gone to the bathroom. And four inches wide. Um, and we are going to start this at $8 and 30 seconds. And there it goes. It is running. Tonala Pottery Owl. <laughs> Two more display cabinets. Um, so the train starts at 12 o'clock um, p.m. on Saturday and Sunday. On the 27th and 28th. And I'm kicking it off both days. On Sunday, I'll be selling this. Because this is, I believe, Washington glass. Mount Washington class um, out of Massachusetts. You have to research it a little bit more, but I'm pretty sure Mount Washington glass is out of Massachusetts. I was really excited when I discovered that. I was like, oh, wait a second. I can sell that. <laughs> pig paperweight. Do you see any pig paperweights? Did I just buy a pig paperweight that I forgot about? Oh, 
All right. We'll see you later. Maybe tomorrow. Awesome. <laughs> All right. Suze DC is our winner for $23. Congratulations. Thank you very much. On uh, green. Oh, baking glass. I saw your comment on the video. I, I read your comment. I'm going to have to look into that. I will have to look into that. I think I actually just brought the box in too. All right, this Jack in the Pulpit. I think I bought this Jack in the Pulpit for the Jack in the Pulpit sale that was months and months ago, and then it got lost and it just resurfaced. So now we have it. Um, let's run this. You know, I also have a candle holder in the back from Sandwich Glass that's extremely rare, and I debated listing that, but I'm also slightly nervous because I know it's worth a ton of money. <laughs> it's been on my shelves for a very, very long time. Um, you guys may have saw, saw it. It's the, the dolphin candle holder that's cobalt and milk glass. Check my pulpit. UV. UV face. Um, we're going to start this one at... I'm going to start this one at 35 because I feel like the higher we start it, <laughs> the, um, the faster the bidding will go. So this is going to be... Alrighty, so this is super glowy, obviously. Um, my guess is that it's Victorian. Add to stream. Move to stage. All right, here we go. Uh, okay, so there are no chips or cracks on this. It is hand blown. You can see the ponto score on the bottom. Um, the edge is pink. And as I demonstrated, it's super glowy. <laughs> so we are going to start it at $35, 30 seconds. And here it goes. The pig from Florida. So um, all of the items from Florida that I had remaining are preloaded on Saturday's sale. I don't remember there being a pig. Maybe there was. But I've been preloading everything on Saturday sale. I only have a few more items left to go. So my next few sales are preloaded, um, including Saturday. So that's uh, the... Uh... Sorry, mom just sent me a text. <laughs> um... So yeah, you can hop in and you can see what, what's available there. There might be a pig. What video, what, what place did I get the pig from? Do you remember? If you tell me where I got it. Oh, the pig. I remember the Murano pig. I, uh, we sold that on, on a video. The Murano pig with the crazy eyes. If that's the one you're talking about. We sold that on knickknacks. All right, we have a winner, Connie Jones. Congratulations on the Jack in the Pulpit. It is a beauty. Fantastic. All right, I'm going to leave that one on the top of the cart because that concludes our sale. All right, so <laughs> I'm going to sit down for a second. <laughs> We have another sale tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern. Tomorrow is Wednesday. I don't know the actual date, but it's Wednesday, 4 p.m. Eastern. Uh, we're going to be right back here. Come and join us on knickknacks.net. That is N-I-K-N-A-X.net. You have to be on Knickknacks to participate in the sale. You can watch from Facebook and you can watch from YouTube, but in order to participate in the sale itself, you have to be on knickknacks. Um, so if you see something you like, you want to bid on, you have to be here with us. Um, what else was I going to say? I think that's really all I, I needed to say. Um, yeah, so hopefully you guys can join me. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to raid now into Moon Sky, and she's going to take you on a wonderful journey into our usual Tuesday groovy train. Um, it's called the groovy train, but it's just a wide variety of vintage and antiques. Um, Christina is doing a shop the shelves. So it's similar to this. You get to pick stuff off her shelves, and she will run it for you. Um, it's very exciting. So if you're watching on YouTube or Facebook, 
hop on over and you could do some more shopping of the shelves. She's got some really great items. If you saw the, the, the um, Where in the World Mexico reel we did, those were Christina's items. I saw some people asking about the tiger in those videos and I'm like, it's not mine, it's Christina's. Um, so <laughs> so you might wanna you might wanna jump on over. Um, but yes, let's go and do um do this this raid and hopefully I see you guys tomorrow, 4 p.m. Eastern, right here on knickknacks.net. Um, so, so, so you see Christina's show, you hop on over here to knickknacks.net, and she will be the, the sale that is live. She will be live. Her her username is Moon Sky Vintage. Moon Sky. Um, so just come on over here to knickknacks. N-I-K-N-A-X dot net. Let me show you the sticker one last time. Here we go. Knickknacks dot net. That is where you need to be. That's where all the cool kids are. Knickknacks dot net. All right. Now I'm going to send those of you who are here on Knickknacks over. Um, and it will disconnect our friends over on Facebook and YouTube. And stream and raid but come on over and join us oh and hgh boutique is selling some jewelry as well she is selling some jewelry so if you want to look at some jewelry hgh boutique is selling some jewelry right now as well um, but we're going to raid over into moon sky because i said i was going to do it so that's where we're heading um, but if you want to go see some jewelry go check out hgh boutique